What's up guys, it's Zenodiac here and in this small tutorial video I'm just going to show you how to customize your start menu icon button like I have here on top of mine. If you ever so wish to spice up your life a little and you're bored of the old Windows one, you can use this guide in order to change it to your liking. And there's basically only two things that you need in order to do this, where the first thing and obvious thing is your picture. Right here I have made two pictures that can be used in this tutorial for it to work and um, I think this is a general property that your start button icon needs to have for it to work and that is basically that you need three different pictures that, or a picture that can be divided into three different parts of equal sizes so as when you hover your mouse over it it changes without the pictures being overlapped so my two pictures here have different widths and different lengths but they can be div both divided into three equal parts which is the only property your picture actually needs I will post a link in the video description somewhere um, to make one of those pictures if you have trouble doing that the second thing you need is a program called classic shell and classic shell is free software which you can uh, search for in Google and uh, it should show up as classicshell.net um, and you can basically use the software to customize your start menu um, in whichever ways you want. I am currently using Windows 10 but it works for Windows 7, 8.1, 8, 1, 8 yeah, and 10 as well. So you just click the download button and it's quite small I think it's about yeah 6.65 megabytes and once you've downloaded that and installed it there should be a option for it in your start menu right on top here classic start menu settings or you can just search for it and it should appear also as uh, classic start menu settings. Once you've clicked on it, it opens up the little box and uh, in all of these tabs we are interested in the start menu style option here. So we click on that and here you can choose um, the styles that you want to use. Um, I for one don't really like the Windows uh, 10 start bar so I uh, picked the Windows 7 style and what we are interested in is the custom option here for the button. And here you can pick an image, let me choose a different one, the other one I made. And uh, if you open it, it should change automatically and it does. So you can see um, it picks it up quite nicely as you hover your mouse over it and click on it. Um, but the sizes are a bit different, so well, it doesn't really fit. So you can change the size for in order for it to fit. Let's make it smaller, let's make it 20. Press OK. Oh, and then that's way too small, so let's uh, change it again, let's maybe make it 50, and 50 looks about right. And you can do this with any image that can be divided into three equal parts and it should work perfectly. Alright guys, uh, thank you for watching, I'm not gonna ask you to subscribe or anything, you can dislike the video if you want, you can like the video if you want, or you can comment.